This is Guy Delosier, Senior Applications Engineer at Go Engineer. Today I want to talk about inserting a part into an existing part file. For instance, this part that I've got on screen, partly designed, I need a lug to put on this thing so we can bolt this thing down. I've already got existing lugs, so I just want to bring one in and use it. So what I want to do here is to bring in another part. I go to the insert menu and halfway down is part. Click on that and then the browse menu comes right up. I want this mounting lug. That's what I want. I got a couple configurations of the mounting lug. I can just pick that and now for 2019 I can select the configuration. This was not here previously before 2019. I can pick what configuration I want. Well, if I forget to do that and just say open and bring this in, now I've got the second chance. I can go over here and I can pick which one I want, short, which is the one I had, or uh, long, long, that's really the one I want. And I can just put this where I want it. And then I can move this thing and position it with move copy body, mirror a second one over to the other side as a separate body and then combine these bodies together and finish up my part. So that makes it very easy. Previously in SolidWorks it wasn't quite so easy to bring in that. We'd have to bring in whatever configuration came up and then change it. So I would have to come over to the feature tree and right click and pick external references or list external references in earlier versions and I could see my configurations here then and pick the one I want and say OK, close, and change the configuration. 2019, they made it a lot easier to get where we need to go and do the things we need to do. Guy Delosier, Senior Applications Engineer, Go Engineer.